so sick of you dumping in the deep. And I'll tell you what, I'm coming to your door. All right, I just got called from uh, neighbors. That is our fresh dump site. And it's gonna be over here at Virgil, just south of Midland here. And it's right over by my house. I actually happened to be home all day, but I was calling other dumpers. I didn't get a chance to peep this out, so. I'm gonna go ahead and meet them over here real quick. See what we can find. Oh, right on. So tell me what you've seen here, man. This is this is the second time they've come back, right? Somebody. Yeah. Dug through almost every single bag before I find one. Yeah, it looks down like with looks like somebody got a good uh we have on their home and we get all the trash. I think it's a rental. It's got somebody's name, addresses. Mostly on Raphael. Dale Street, huh? Mostly Raphael and then there's like one or two with somebody else. And this is Oliver and Don Holmes. So there's like the three names. Dale Street, they're all the same. All the same address. All the same address. Just up there by the uh, north of the cemetery. What are the dates on those? That's one real thing that we're, we've got to be sticklers on is dates. Just trying to see the contents. This looks like. So what do you want to do? Do you want to just take it back right now? Just say fuck it, you know? Load it all up in your truck. It's a landlord. I mean, I don't think it has anything to do with these people. Right, yeah, I know that. Uh, all right, we're not very far. We just got off of Telegraph here on a Puritan, which is halfway in between. That's Puritan, no. That's Puritan right there. We're on oh. Puritan. Uh, and we're looking for Dale Street. Is this Dale Street? This, yeah. Oh, this is Puritan. Riverview, Puritan. So we're looking for... What was the address again? 16153. 16153. It is 4-3 right here. This is the house. There's somebody in there. There's somebody in that house? Which, oh, that house? Right there. That is the house. Well, I might as well talk with some neighbors since he's home. How are you doing? Sorry to bother you today. Uh, I, let's just have a couple questions about this this address right here. We found a bunch of dumping right over in Brightmore here, and uh, it all comes from this address. Was there any trucks out here today? What kind of trucks were they, ma'am? I think it was yesterday. It was a green truck. Just a regular truck. Just a regular, like a Ford F-150, older style. Wasn't an older style, more like a like an aquamarine color. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay. All right. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. So, it, you know that green truck that we're always talking about? In here? Okay. That's where it comes from. It's, it's those guys. Um, they've got the older body style. Uh, Was it a Chevy or Ford? I think it's a Ford F-150. All right. This is where it all comes from, folks. Uh, you can see they boarded up the the garage in the back there and uh, it doesn't look like there's anybody here I'm gonna take a look and see what I can find all right I think the next thing we can do is uh, I'm gonna surveil this place that's exactly what's gonna happen here looks like we're gonna be doing a return to sender tomorrow hopefully we can find this guy sitting on this place all right, he was already able to, uh, what we do is we use Loveland here in, in, in Detroit. And uh, let me just show you real quick. Loveland has an, a great app. I'll go ahead and twist it a little bit closer to me here. That way we can read it. And at, in, at 16143 Dale Street, 
is owned by YEM Affordable Homes LLC and there goes the rest of it and they're in good standing aren't they yes so that means uh, this is a rental property that they just cleared it out and one of their contractors decided that our neighborhood is the right place now go ahead and show us that other um, we found YEM so we're gonna be able to find these guys rather quickly what I'm gonna do is we're gonna go home and I'm gonna call this guy up and uh, that if people are wondering how we're able to find out this information go to Loveland uh, or <laughs> standard driven Detroit and they've got an app called Loveland active but not in good standing but, oh it's not in good standing it's, it's With, they are uh, open corporates oh okay that's <laughs> what's the phone number right now? Oh, oh, that's the address right there let me see this Woodward Avenue registered Ooh, address we got some yuppies registered address 2967 Woodward Ave Ferndale Michigan and the na agent's name is Adiola I die in me <laughs> let's see if we can find a phone number Well, that's our next step. We're going to find a phone number. <laughs> all right, it never ends here in the, the city. Uh, we've got all this burned up siding here. This is all brand new stuff. And uh, we just got blessed with it here. I mean, we've already got an address. Almost. You think that's 16143 <laughs> Dale Street? <laughs> <laughs> you think? That's Dale Street. This is all coming from the same spot. So they, they hit us twice today. They hit us twice today. All right, here we go. Here goes. And uh, boy, oh boy. I catch you fuckers. 16143 Dale Street. Um, this all correlates coming from the same spot. The bags are all tied up the same way too. Right, they're all tied up the same way. They all come from that area. They just looks like they cut down a bunch of uh, twigs and branches. We're gonna look for that next time we go out there. Uh, they got a brand new hot water tank and we get the trash. Oh. Oh. They get a brand new furnace. Brand new cabinets. Here goes the vanity combo. And they took a vanity out over there. There's the remains of the vanity over there. I'll bet you this is all coming from the same place. I'm going to start rattling some cages tonight. I'm going to start calling around, see if I can get a hold of the owner of this. To see they've got all the same place. bags over there. Yep. They're all tied up the same All way. this tile right here. I'm thinking we can match it up to this tile that's on the, on the other one that's exactly what we'll do we're gonna tie all this in together we already tie tied this stuff here uh, if it's not, this is all old but it's the same damn address so thing is, this, they clean out the garage <laughs> they clean out the bathroom they clean out everything in this place even if it's not all theirs I think they should pick it all up right even that stuff is in there. exactly If you guys think there's nobody paying attention, you're you're sadly mistaken. Oh, this, this tote? Yeah. There was a list to it over there on Virgil. Right. <laughs> right. <laughs> Fucking bastards. All right, let's get you home to your wife. No need for us to be out here any longer. Ew. Oh, and we got we get one of these frickin' condoms on the ground and then the wet nap. So they've been turning their trips, tricks over here as well. What are we doing, Bubs? Turn the sink.
Travels. Come on, Mayor Duggan, where are you at? <laughs> All right, we've got two trucks loaded up. Uh, we've only got one of the piles. Uh, most of the way cleaned up. We're going to take it back to Dale Street right now. We're going to make Brightmore great again. Stay tuned, folks. All right, let's get we were picking up. Uh, I would not doubt it, to be quite honest with y'all. You know, I live, like I said, two doors down. He won six one four three. You suck. Here's your shit back. Tell you what, you dumping in a D, you better expect to see their crap. So, back on your lawn. We have another site to go to and bring more back. We just didn't have the room. Nope. <laughs> and that's what's fucked up. Sad to see the shit that got back where it belongs, but it's glaring out an empty lot that somebody owns. Want to go to www.bobnut.com. <laughs> <laughs> He's always advertising. <coughs> Don't you think the fuck nut app would be perfect to get? Oh, absolutely. Like we should have her start working on like it. Jonathan. It's like, right. We're going to have her maybe work on it. <coughs> Instead of improved Detroit. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The fuck nut app. Yeah. Yeah. It all gets brought back. <laughs> you own a house and you need to clean it out. Go get yourself a dumpster. Saves you the, the problem of having me come to your door, bringing your trash back to you. Not only that, it's cheaper in the long run. Oh, this guy's gonna get a, at least a $500 ticket. I'm gonna see if I can get him two tickets for two different dump sites. And uh, what we're gonna do, we bring it back here and we're gonna fill up the front right here. We can also call uh, Improved Detroit. Well, it's an app. We'll go ahead and put it out there on, on the app. We also contact DPD and what you're gonna do is you're gonna get a ticket and you're gonna have the city come out and clean this up within a reasonable amount of time that's what we're gonna do in here and uh, we're gonna see if we can find these guys at a later time so we can shame them on my YouTube site glad to see this room. happen in a way but it's better than an empty field right I'm sorry what's your name Dawn Dawn Lisa hi Jonathan's wife good to hi. meet you Load number one, status complete.
I've established myself so well, I don't want to move the business. No, I, I get you. All right, this is this is load number one. We've got one more load to go. Tell you what, no more dumping in a D. <laughs> Have fun with it, asshole. No dumping in the D. No dumping in the D.